All right, TikTok. So this is my like quick. I don't want to put my thing up. This is my like kind of quick review of God of War Ragnarok. I know the game been out for a while, but recently, but I, I want to say recently, I'm still playing it now, I'm trying to 100 percent everything and beat the berserkers, and berserkers and artifacts and collectibles and stuff. But beat the story to it, and I never got a chance to really talk about my thoughts about the game. So I figured, hey, today will be a day I got some free time. First of all, God of War Ragnarok, if you liked it, the 2018 God of War, buy this game. I don't care if people will tell you this is an add-on DLC. Um, it's just it's, it's just the same game with just different stuff to it. No, buy God of War Ragnarok. The story alone for this game is, is the top seller of it. Combat has been changed a little bit since uh, 2018. Like There's some me melee moves that have been taken out. In place of that, we have another third weapon with the spear. Get the gameplay of Atreus. Get the introduction of, of uh, more characters and more gods. Introduction of Thor, Odin, the Asgardians, and basically adding more to the Norse realm stuff. I, really, I believe this game is supposed to run into like a trilogy, but they decided to do just two of it to complete the story of uh, the Aesir stuff and Norse mythology. I like it a lot. I like the fact that you get to play with Atreus and what he's going to become in the future as far as uh, what the direction of the franchise is heading towards. I like what they're doing with that, with the whole giant stuff and him discovering, uh, basically searching out in the world for his people, basically. As Faye was a giant herself, Jornheim, I think you recall, I don't, don't, don't call me I know the, the names of it. I'm going to be butchered in my, <laughs> in my look to it. And also Kratos being developed as a character, as someone who basically became a god of hatred and war and stuff. People are now friends when people actually love Kratos as uh, a guy to look up to instead of just a guy for destruction. That's really cool. Although you do cause Ragnarok and the destruction of Asgard, so spoiler. I like I like the outcome of this game. Uh, even even now that I'm still going through this, uh, extra stuff and everything, I like it a lot. God of War Ragnarok has some cool gameplay. The spear mechanic into the thing is really cool. I wish you got to actually play as Freya as you go along, but you don't, sadly. Overall, if you like the 2018 God of War, I would say definitely pick up God of War Ragnarok. It's basically a must play. That's all I got to say about it. I will add more to comment on if I do like a really long video on my YouTube channel, but this is as far as I go for just talking about it right now. But without further ado, it's it. Sign out.